and welcome again to the Lord of the Charles videos. In this tutorial I'm going to show you a CLI tool for inspecting the state of a, of a Kubernetes cluster. In this case the tool is called K9S. Let's see it in action. Okay, let's see K9S in action. This is the website. You can just go here. This is the logo, which is a yeah, really nice logo, I guess. So this is the site, so you, you just need to go here to releases. Currently I'm using the 0 0.5.0, and then you just need to download it, depending on Linux, Windows, or Mac. In this case I have, um, I'm, or I have a cluster, it's an OpenShift cluster, which is a Kubernetes 3.11 with this version 0 0.5.0 running. And currently the example contains also Istio installed. So let's do uh, KNS. K9S minus N tutorial because this is the namespace where I have everything installed and then you see here that I have a customer preference and two versions of recommendation with all the information of the of the cluster the uh, the version the um, the IP the port the user and so on and so forth and then for example I can just go inside the customer and I can see that there are two running containers this is completed and this running is the custom the customer which is the the, ser uh, the service itself and this is the istio proxy okay then you can see also the age the, the cpu the memory and so on so forth okay then for example i can just go here to the customer and if i push the l button i can see the logs of the um, of the pod of course if it goes here to the proxy and i put l i can see the logs of the istio proxy also, if I, uh, if I want, I can just push the S, which you can see here, this is going to the shell, and now notice that I'm inside the pod, so I can just apply some shell um, scripts or shell commands inside the pod. If I do exit, uh, sorry, exit, then I get back to the, um, to the K9S. To go uh, back, I just need to push the P, and then I'm again here with the customer preference recommendation. Then, for example, I can do a D, which is a describe, and I can just, you know, check uh, everything. You see that you see here the container of the proxy and also the customer one with all the information. I can do ask to go back. Then, uh, so I can, you know, sort by CPU memory. Uh, or whatever, I can check the logs, which now it let me choose which logs, the customer for example, again, is the same. And finally, um, well, it's just, you know, really uh, interesting everything. If I push the I, I can see the YAML of, the, um, of these containers. And I think that that's all. Well, yes, you can even, for example, do a slash and then you can um, filter. For example, I can do customer and then I just see the customer uh, information. If I go, for example, for uh, preference, then I get it, the preferences. And I think that, I mean, that that's all. It's really a nice project that you should use if you are into um, Kubernetes and you just, you know, want to inspect what's going inside the cluster. Hope you enjoy it. If you like it, just thumbs up. And if you want to stay updated with other videos about Java or Kubernetes or useful CLI tools for developers, just subscribe to the channel or just follow me on Twitter where you can find the links just in the description. See you and bye bye.